No matter how many times I show this watch and tell people that the strap and the fitted end links are Clockwork Republic, I'll still get the question. So, another designated video just for Clockwork Republic, this time to announce the release of the end links for the Samurai. The Seiko Samurai is an awesome watch. Many people love it, many people wear them, many people own them. It's time to elevate them by getting the Clockwork Republic strap. I can confidently tell you guys that the Clockwork Republic system is easily my choice. Like it lives on the SKX and I have other strap options and bracelet options. I'm a bracelet guy traditionally. I will occasionally put this one back on bracelet, but a lot of the times it's just on the Clockwork Republic. It's just that comfortable depending on uh, the weather and your wrist swell and everything like that. It gives you that uh, quick adjustment option that most bracelets just don't have. They have the little pin, you know, you gotta move it and everything like that. You don't have to do that with straps. They just already do that. So uh, pretty much the same price structure with the Samurai as is with the SKX and 5KX systems. You're looking at $57.90 for the silver variant. If you want to go with the PVD coated black or they actually even have now the um, rose gold and gold and stuff like that for the modders out there. But most of the colors are going to be the silver or the black. Uh, I mean, this black ninja samurai here is like, this is an obvious choice for sure. So, um, yeah, if you had one of these, this one's my buddy Mark's watch. So I fitted it out with these uh, Clockwork Republic end links and the black colorway. Now you could mix and match however you wanted to do it. You know, you could go with the gray one on this one or maybe even the green one would be fun. There are no orange options yet. So I need to talk to the owner there and uh, maybe an orange strap would be cool. But right now they're still working on other models. You know, the most popular watches out there are gonna be the Seiko watches. So it's easy to kind of attack those first. Uh, but really, you're looking at most of them are going to need to be the 22 millimeter lug width. So you're looking at the, you know, the, the larger divers with the 22 mil lug there. And it's a lot of work. It's a lot of money to invest in the casting and get everything fitted. And then the straps are the same. So you can, once you have one system, then you could buy a few different loose straps. And those are, you know, obviously going to be less money. And then you have the option to change it out however you want to do it. Now the black one is $61.90, so small premium over there. In the description, I will put a an affiliate link. That's right, an affiliate link. It doesn't cost you any more money, but it does help the channel. So that is uh, literally, as far as I can remember, uh, Clockwork Republic is the only company that I've set up that affiliate with, other than like if I post like an Amazon affiliate. But check out that black one. I mean, that is just perfect. And it's crazy comfortable. This is FKM rubber. Uh, if you're not familiar with that, it's very similar to like vulcanized rubber. If you're familiar with that, um, it's very smooth yet pliable. No, it doesn't smell like vanilla. It's not like the, the real infused rubber that smells like vanilla or anything like that. But it is uh, very uh, comfortable and stretchy and flexible, but yet still rigid enough that it holds its... Uh, uh, overall shape that's not gonna like stretch out on you or anything like that so let me pop this silver one on I just put the gray strap on there because the blue strap I have is already on the SKX so otherwise this one would look really good on the blue I think but the gray works as well I had another gray strapped uh, 5kx it's actually out on a watch tour right now otherwise I would have shown that one as well um, and that one looks really good because it's the silver dial 5kx but uh, there it is on the Samurai, guys. Really nice fitting on the end links and, of course, the straps. So let me know what you think. Definitely check out Clockwork Republic, whether you have the Samurai, the SKX, the 5KX, uh, or the mods. So, like, mod cases, they're, they're still working on it and making sure they all fit. Uh, there's going to be a chance that maybe they won't fit. You know, that's part of the modding world. If you're in the modding world, you know that some parts just won't work for whatever reason, uh, tolerances and variants. But if you have a mod case, uh, definitely look at the strap option as well, because this is a, you know, aftermarket case, uh, with the, and it fits the SKX end links, then give it a try. It might work for you. And if you have like weird, you know, gold or rose gold cases or something like that, then you can 
uh, put one of these straps on that watch. It'd be a pretty fun mod. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you on the next video.